crop protection do you know still the production of crop has many other obstacles to be taken care some of them are weeds insects and plant diseases now let us learn to find some more details about them weeds did you ever visit a crop in villages then you might observe along with plants in the field you can find some other plants with them those plants are called as weeds do you know how the weeds affect the plants the weeds affect the water supply nutrients sunshine etc which are available to the plants hence the field should be weeded at regular intervals insects and plant diseases apart from weeds plants are also affected by insects but there are also some insects which eat the stems of the plants nibble the leaves and destroy the roots thus affect the production of crop other than insects some of the microorganisms also destroy the crops even though some of the microorganisms help in the supply of nitrogen to the plants but some others destroy the crops we can't see the microorganisms on the plants but we can find how it causes destruction to the plants microorganisms causes shriveling and discoloration of leaves rusting of stems and leaves fungal growths etc hence to protect the crops farmers supply insecticides fungicides and chemicals etc to the crop but even though those insecticides chemicals etc are helpful to the crop from pests they're also being harmful to the health of the human beings let us find how when chemicals are sprayed to the plants most of them remain in the soil and find their way into the water sources which are harmful to the human health when the farmers spray chemicals to the field they're also getting exposed to them inhale them and thus it enters into the human body alternative measures are introduced to prevent such complications for example natural pest controlling methods along with harmful insects we can also find some eco-friendly insects which help to protect the crop from these harmful insects for example spiders dragonfly ladybird beetle mirrors etc these insects eat worms like jacets chips and stem borers etc some bacteria like trichoderma bacterium bacillus turingiensis destroy some of the pests in the egg stage itself mixed crops also can control some of the pest and insect diseases cultivation of black gram or groundnut after paddy crop prevents tungro virus on paddy after cotton cultivation of maize and gingaili prevents the gram caterpillar after red gram cultivation of maize and corn prevents spotted bowl worm and dry diseases thus with introducing natural control methods both improvement in food production and sustaining soil health and environmental protection can be achieved